Great. Um, first of all, I just want to say um, hello to everybody and thank you so much for being here. <laughs> yes. Thanks, Terry. Thank you. Oh my gosh, it's it's so great to see your faces, at least in this <laughs> way. And when I talked with Michael about the new year and the new way of viewing Joey's song, Michael, it's the 10th anniversary. I'm gonna start with you real quick. Um, I know you wanted this to be extra special in its 10th year. And in many ways, it is going to be extra special <laughs> because you could still end up having a bigger audience and more participation than ever because of having to go virtual. That's right. What do you think? Uh, you, you said it perfectly, right? It, it's the, uh, we, had to, we had to take what Mother Nature threw at us, right? We had, you and I have talked, Terry, on and off since the last one, and we were going bigger this year with the physical event. We were going to the, the Sylvie and, and you know, everything with that entails a, a bigger venue than that. And Mother Nature is not allowing us to do that. So we're going to take it all online, which opens up other doors, which is just, as you said, it's going to allow us to have a much bigger audience. A garbage fan in, you know, Pomona, California can now watch or a Delamitri right. fan in Buenos Aires can, you know what I mean? It's it. We do, we're not limited to who can walk through the door at the Barrymore or the Sylvie. Mike, there, there, aren't any awesome. there aren't any Delamitri there, fans in Buenos Aires. There has to be. There has to be. <laughs> no, but it's, it's official. There are none in Buenos Aires. <laughs> no, but, but, um, <laughs> oh my okay after the show there will be at least one <laughs> that's right <laughs> well butch i'm going to jump to you you have been involved every year this has allowed us to do talked about hold on mike you're freezing up here yeah <laughs> and so the yeah, I'm looking you well. What should sure you and I just take talk? that? I, I, I'm surprised. <laughs> yeah, what? So, what were you saying, this, Terry? I'll have to get well, the, uh, I, I, the squirrel honestly, on the wheel running faster. Can you guys hear me now? Me. Am I better? Oh, there yeah. you go. Oh, now you're all frozen. Uh oh. Yeah. Yes, do, do that. Do that. Okay. Um, Butch, okay. I, I had the honor of meeting you a couple of years ago when you came to the radio station, talked about Joey's song, and just looking at your face and your eyes, I could tell what it means to you to be involved. I know you do so many different things, but this just blows me away how you always make this and, and being able to create awareness and education and raise money for epilepsy. Why does this mean so much to you, Butch? Well, I mean, ep epilepsy is a terrible disease, and I have a couple of close friends who suffer from it. In fact, one of the best men at my wedding um, suffers from it, and I've, I've been with him when he's had seizures, and it is scary. It is it's terribly scary. Um, and when I, I, I've known Mike for a long time, but when he first told me the story about his son, Joey, it's, it's such a powerful and tragic thing that can happen to a family, and... Um, and it, by getting involved, you know, with music, uh, music has the power to heal people and, and bring people together in a communal way. And and so that, that, the, that's the reason I got into it. But the real reason is because it is so much fun. I mean, I get to play with all these incredible musicians. We usually pick a lot of cover songs, some we've never played before. And um, it, it's an excuse to hang out with uh, cool people and, um, and, and just play crazy songs, you know, that uh, sometimes maybe we shouldn't be attempting, but <laughs> we do anyway. And, um, and so I, this is, we're excited about this year because this is the first time, like you mentioned, Terry, we're going to potentially hit, hit a way bigger audience. You know, normally they're Madison venues and there's a certain, uh, you know, a limit to like a thousand people or wherever we could get right. into the venue, but we, we could be way beyond that this year. So we're, we're very excited about reaching out and finding a new audience for Joey's song. Well, we will miss you not coming to the studio, but I love and anticipate what this definitely could be this year. And you know we'll be tuning in and sharing it, and it, it's going to be terrific. And, of course, we I want to ask... Terry, we, we like coming to the radio station because we always get to play some covers live on the air, too, which is pretty fun. I know. And we love it. This is my favorite part about when you guys do this, not just getting to see all of you again, 
but often you'll come in and decide as the mics are live what you're going to play or you'll have just worked it out five minutes ahead of time and it's still even though i played music as a you know young younger person it blows me away to watch you guys create right in front of us it's just amazing yeah cool it's it's fun that, that's why we do it a lot of it is because we're having fun when we do it well thank you we'll look forward to next year and now i want to ask justin okay this is your first time being part of this yeah. Justin. What, what made you decide, okay, got to do this. I have to do this. Well, I've, I've, because I've been constantly turning Mike down over the years because I've not been able to get to the States for the gigs much as I've, I've really wanted to join in. It, it, does, uh, it does sound like a really fun night. So this, this is an, an opportunity for me, you know, for me to join in without having to get on a plane. So it's easy for me. So what do you anticipate to bring this particular evening, again, set in a different way, which is going to be terrific, that you hope people will tune in for? Well, what, 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 what I've done with my performances, I've, I've added in um, a special ingredient known as mistakes. <laughs> um, and these are, these, are mistakes, these are mistakes that are unique to this event and will never be repeated again. <laughs> so we need yeah, to know. watch just because of that. Yeah, and also I had my girlfriend filming me, and um, uh, she kept giving me giving me funny looks, and I kept cracking up. And I thought, well, that seems to be that that, that we'll keep that. That's in the that's in the spirit of the joy of the event. Yeah, I mean, it's you know, the COVID has lowered the bar, so you you're going to see people, warts and all, are just playing in a very intimate uh, performances. You know, some are DIY; they just turn on their camera and film themselves. I was lucky; my 14 year old daughter directed me, and and. She was a tough director, too. Oh, my. Okay, so you have just, between the two of you right there, given us a million reasons to watch. Obviously, <laughs> from the, the technical standpoint, who's involved in the show with you, but then, of course, just the, the music and the good cause all around it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah it's uh, it, it's going to be a, a really unique show. Everybody really poured their guts into it. I mean, all the performances. I, I haven't seen them all. Mike has seen them all, but... Um, just from what I've heard, um, everybody's going for it, you know, so, and, and there's going to be a lot of different uh, ebb and flow and stylistically what people are playing, and, and uh, so it's going to be cool, and I think it's going to really pull people in for the whole broadcast. I think so, too. You know, Michael, back to you, if, if you can hear us and speak with us. <laughs> well, I mean, what, keep, what keeps driving you to do this, and, and you have, you told me at the end of last year's show that this was incredible, it was the biggest ever, but you said you weren't satisfied it was going to be bigger in 2020. And, and somehow you're making this. How do you keep doing this every year? Is it because it's for Joey? I'm sure there's, I, it would cost a therapist $200 an hour to help me <laughs> all of that stuff out. I think it's a combination of things. It is, I know what our family went through. And if there's something that we can do big or small, to take some of that burden off of, you know, as if you watch any of our videos, we always talk about the next family, right? So if there's anything we can do to, to remove that burden, that's part of it. Second of all, um, I like, uh, as I said, this is my chance to kind of share my record collection with the world, which I'm doing with all these guys. And third, I like the fact that I get to know these guys, right? The, the musicians, all of the folks. Some of them, when they come and play, are brand new uh, that I've you know, never met before. Some of them are like the two guys that are on the phone that I've known for decades. Um, I, as somebody that, that uh, can not even carry a tune in the shower, um, <laughs> you know, I think I use the phrase with Butch, I can't carry a tune. I, I know that feeling. Beat, but I can project manage until the cows come home. Um, right. And yeah. that, that's kind of one of the things that I do and I, I enjoy the process. I enjoy the night and I'm going to enjoy it on Wednesday the 16th, you know, when, when, when we're done with that as well. So I think it's all of those things. It's a combination that, that keeps, keeps me doing it. And as long as... He, he was doing well. He was. Yes. Um, you know, there's always an all-star jam of sorts at the end. Which, what do we do without that this year? Are you guys going to be able to do anything together or do you try to do anything together? Or is that just something we're going to have to wait for next year? There's no all-star jam like we usually do at the Barrymore or whatever, which is one of the funnest parts of the evening when everybody gets up and just yeah. goes for it. 
Um, we in the KIB we did four tracks uh, that um, that we recorded like a band. Oh. Um, like I started, I recorded the drums here by myself first, and then sent that sent the files out, and everybody did their parts. Everybody you know everybody played live on it, but then sent it back here. Um, and so I think you'll get a sense of of a of a band performance, at least in the four that we did. And, and we did that intentionally. We wanted to, just because we wanted to include everybody who has been in the previous uh, Joey song. So, um, but like I said, every performance, even the four we did are all completely different. Um, part of it is just how people uh, film themselves and, and also um, the songs we chose. Um, there's some there's a couple that are kind of head scratchers that are really cool, oh, <laughs> but good. I don't want to give it away yet. So you're going to have to watch to find okay. out. Okay. And Justin, you said you're solo. Yes. What? I think, the, I think my cat made make an appearance. I'm not very really sure. I saw. <laughs> and, yeah. But, uh, <laughs> yeah. yeah. That's like a I typical actually, thing, right? Yeah. I've done, <laughs> I've, I've done a few of these things for like local Scottish TV. And when you do them on your own, it's quite hard to raise your performance level. Um, so this time, I, I got my uh, I got my girlfriend to, to film it, which just it just kind of as long as there's one other person in the room listening, you feel like there's an audience. Yeah, that is. I, I'm just so excited for all of you and really grateful to have you be able to take this time to join us. I was. I'm going to tell you, I was looking forward to talking to Glenn with uh, Toad the Wet Sprocket. Uh, Glenn and I had a chance to meet years ago when I was uh, working in Green Bay, Wisconsin, and I was in television then, and we introduced his show, and he was very gracious and let us hang out with him after the show. So I was looking forward to some fun stories I had to share about him, but cool. I guess that will have to wait, Michael. We'll just look forward <laughs> yeah. to uh, having uh, he as part of this amazing show that you guys are doing. Yeah. So yeah, there, there's, 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 there's lots of pretty amazing people involved as well. So, um, and so Terry, just, I know we're running out the end time. Since no! I have been, oh, sorry. Since, <laughs> since, since, since I have been the uh, technological speed bump on this, if you want to get back and, and re-record some, some of my stuff, we can certainly do sure. that as well too. Cause I don't, okay. I have no idea what you guys heard and didn't hear. And it's usually <laughs> gibberish that comes out of me anyway, but so. Okay, before I let both Justin and Butch go, is there anything that either of you would like to add about being part of this and doing this and looking forward to it? And I guess I'm thinking more of trying to get people to want to tune in. I don't know why they wouldn't want to, but let, let's get them in there. Well, it's free. And there, there's, you're, it's, it's almost three hours of incredible performances that are, are truly unique. Um, you know, you're, it's, you're not going to see a show like this uh, for a while anyway. And um, everybody really has upped their game in terms of what they've delivered, at least from what Mike is telling me. And uh, I'm excited because I haven't seen a lot of the performances, but I, I'm going to be sitting down with a beer, cranking it up on my big speakers, and, uh, and, and I'm going to immerse myself in the experience when it happens. I love Me too. that. How about you, Justin? Yeah, I, I like this beer idea. <laughs> <laughs> I can because I, I I don't drink when I'm working, so now right. I'm actually I've done my work, so I can I can watch the whole show and That's be right. an audience member. Yep. We can all toast <laughs> to each other. Exactly. Right. Oh, right. all right, Michael. Do I have to let them go now? Well, you you actually if you you have another minute before. Oh, uh, oh my gosh. Before. Who would like to share where to find the information? Maybe I can do that since I'm technically <laughs> okay. uh, connected again. I had, to, I had to go upstairs and grab my iPad because that's a better connection than my, my Mac. Um, so there's two places that I would suggest that people go to watch the show, either to joeysong.org, and there's a big button on it right now. You can go today that says watch the live stream, um, and that's where it will be broadcast as well as Facebook Live. Um, so both of those places will start at 7 p.m. on the 16th. Um, as, as Butch said, the show is free, but we are doing this for a reason. Uh, we are doing this to raise some money. Um, and so donations are appreciated. And what I would suggest to anybody that's listening to this right now, um, if you think about it, if you want to go now, we can take donations right now. I'm going to use an old analogy, but you know, the old days when we would say, you know, keep the phone lines open for everybody else. <laughs> yeah. You know, don't, don't wait until the evening of the 16th. If you're so moved to, to donate to our cause, go in now, 
uh, make the donation. Um, and then that way you can join Justin and Butch cracking open that beer and you don't have Got to, it. you don't have to worry about hitting the, uh, hitting the button on your computer. So I Mike, the what's, the best, what's, what's the best way for us to interact with the audience? Facebook Live or? Yeah, do, do yeah. Facebook yeah. Live. Yeah, Facebook Live, they'll be, the comment section will be up and going and I'm sure, hopefully there'll be a lot of stuff going on on that as well. Yep. And you will be watching, so you'll be able to have a conversation. Exactly, you... yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's so great. Yeah, I've done a oh, Facebook people Live will thing. really love that. I did a Facebook Live thing years ago and mm -hmm. uh, you know, just performing to, on my own to, to camera and it was it was quite hard to interact with the audience because you're playing a guitar so you can't actually <laughs> play to anybody yeah so this time this time hopefully i'll be able to interact better with uh, whoever's out there yeah, yeah. well beer in one the, hand and facebook ready to answer in the other that's right yeah, yeah that's perfect justin you are a doll and i can't wait for you to come and see us here at some point but i'm so looking forward to your performance well, thank you for doing this from everyone that cares about joey's song and trying to find some kind of um, cure for this. Thank you so much, Justin. And folks, you. you're just the best. I love you, you're the best. Oh, thank <laughs> oh, thanks, Gary. Yeah, yeah. All right, and, and like 